Hello everyone, today I'm reviewing Three Click Laguna. Here's the box. Um, unfortunately something went wrong with the review, so I've had to, I took her out of the box. Um, it's the same as Draculaura's really. It's your Shriek Rep Laguna Blue Door of the Sea Monster and it's got really cool artwork on the back of it, like all the ship and everything. I love it, the sharks. I think I've got it upside down. I have. <laughs> Here we go. That's how it's supposed to go. I like that. There we go. I love the artwork of her there. She's really pretty. Nordical doors. And here is the back of the box. We have nice artwork over there, and I love the way this looks like a treasure map. Shriek wrecked. And it's got Dracula and Rochelle. I love the treasure on it as well. It's really cool. I like the boxes for this, which is a first. I don't like a lot of the reboot packaging. So I want to show you Dracula. I've um, I brushed her hair out and I put some mousse in it to make it look a little better because it was really really bad it looks better than it did and I used that mousse there firm hold it's from Superdrug she's really pretty she looks much better with a bit more of a with her hair a bit tidier here's Laguna she comes with Neptuna unfortunately her fangs are not painted in this release whereas with the original one they were I think the colours are the same so I have Neptuna over here on the shelf. I don't know if you can see, but she has painted fangs. But unfortunately this one does not, which is a shame. Because it's weird because they painted the fangs on Count Fabulous, but they didn't on Neptuna. How weird. I don't know why they did that. She comes with this bag, which I love. It's like, um, it's got a lifesaver at the top and then it looks like a ship. It's got a star there and it's got like sea like waves at the bottom it looks like. It's really cool. I love the way it's shaped and it opens. It's very similar to Draculaura's the way it opens. But it's good that you can put stuff in it. <clears throat> I love her hair. I love the big pigtails. So she's got huge pigtails and they're really soft and silky and they're blonde and blue. Really long and a little bit of a curl to them. They're really cute. I love them. They just feel so nice. They were actually tied in the box separately as well with things around them. So I was careful not to cut them by mistake. She's just so pretty. I love how big her pigtails are. They're amazing. She has a coral coral piece on her head with the helm of the ship, which is really cool. And it's in black. It also has a, a spider web in the middle, which is cute. She has these cool... Um, star earrings i love them it's got like four stars in a row and they look really cute they're gold really pretty that they have earrings in this line i love it here's her beautiful face she has like a real purpley dark purple eyeshadow which looks really nice on her very beautiful freckles and a very light pink lipstick she's just so pretty <clears throat> and then going down she has these braces and the braces are made of rope not really but they're gold and they look like rope <laughs> they're plastic really and then she has stars there and she has st a star on the back and they um, undo there as you can see they're really cute I like them and then she has this neck scarf which is black and it's sparkly which is really cute and it's like tall material really pretty and then her top and her bottoms are separate they're separate pieces which is really cool so this is pink, pink striped top, and it has like blue stitching around the edges of it, which is really cool. I like that a lot. She has these black gloves. They have a star on them, and they're textured. They've got like loads of texture on them. A bit like the Fright Camera, uh, not Fright Camera, Frights uh, Dance Fright Away. They had textured hands, uh, Frankie and Draculaura. Reminds me of those. <clears throat> and then here's her bottoms. And you would think that they were a skirt, but they're not. They're shorts. They're big baggy shorts, and they're really cute. And they've got loads of stars on them. Them, on, them stars are different. She's got big stars there. She's got little stars. They're blue and black. And she has like yellow splatters on them as well. And she has the helm of the ship. So there's Monster High there in like tattoo art. It's really cool. And then on the bottom she has like some uh, 
stitch in there, very thick black stitch in around the bottoms which look really nice as well. Then going down she has her cool, she has some socks and they're the same as her shirt, they're white and pink and they're really pretty. Her shoes and her socks actually really match her bag as well as you can see. I wish I wish I'd painted that star though gold or something, it would look cute. Still adorable the way it is. And her shoes are so cool. They look really big. They look like boats. They look like a boat, which is really cool. It's got like a little bit of a lip there. And then it's got gold stars and all these swells on it, just like her bag has. Which looks like the sea. And they are cool. These are definitely one of the coolest shoes I've seen. I mean, Dracula is a cool, but I really like these. Because they look like a boat. It's just awesome. As you can see, they are amazing. I love these shoes. And I love this Laguna. She's my favourite from Shriek Wrecked. If I can get her bag on her hand. There you go, Laguna. She's holding it. Let's look at these two girls together. <clears throat> I have Dracula here. She's the other deluxe, one of the other deluxe dolls. He comes with Count Fabulous. I've already reviewed her. Here we go. So here they are together. They look really cool. I love these the Street Crack dolls. They're really cool. Um, very detailed dolls. Let me know what you think of um, Laguna. I think she's really beautiful. Um, let me know what you think of the Street Crack line. Which one is your favourite in the line? Laguna's my favourite. <clears throat> I've also reviewed Draculaura, Dana and Katrine. Is that it? I think so. Yeah. I think that's all of the ones I've reviewed. And out of those, Laguna is my favourite. Obviously, I can't really say of the other ones. I'm not that keen on the others, but if I had them, I might prefer them over her. I don't know, but I think I probably... I don't think I really want those ones as much, but Laguna is my favourite out of all of them. Even over Dana, I just really like her. She's amazing. So, let me know what you think. Like, comment and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye, everyone.